On the 10th of June 1944, a group of soldiers from the De Fuhrer Regiment of the 2nd SS Panzer Division Das Reich entered and then surrounded the small town of Orador Seglane near to the city of Limoges. On the 6th of June 1944, the Allied armies crossed the sea and invaded the Normandy beaches. This was the start of the liberation of Europe. Many lives were to be lost, not forgetting the people of Orador Seglane. This is the peaceful little village of Orador Seglane in happier times when people would walk down to the river to have picnics with their children but little did they know that towards the end of the Second World War in this peaceful part of France and in the village of Orador Seglane there took place a particularly horrible murder of 642 men, women and children. When the DD invasion began on the 6th of June 1944, the Das Reich Regiment was ordered to move north to Normandy to help the rest of the German army repel the Allies and throw them back into the sea. As soon as the SS began to move north, they were attacked by the resistance at every step along the way. They were ambushed and shot at. We must never forget what they did to the villagers. This is the new town of Orador Seglane, just south of Limoges. It was built after the Second World War. But the circumstances of the building of this new town are very sinister. At the end of the village you will find a memorial. Opposite the memorial at the bottom of the new town is the old martyred village of Orador Seglane. <laughs> 